uh, the Milwaukee River raging behind us after all the rain that we had yesterday. Uh, but the storm has made its way on shore uh, in North Carolina, just south of Wilmington. And as you can see, just to the northeast, of, it looks like Myrtle Beach. So this is a Category 1 storm, uh, and it has made its way on landfall. Don't take a look at the seven-day just yet. For some reason, I hit the, the graphic. I'm going to go backwards here. All right, you can see there it is. There's the storm right on the shore of uh, North Carolina. There's the storm itself. You can see that uh, that eye uh, rotating as it moves northwards. So now it's going to bring some heavy rain to North Carolina, Virginia, and pretty much all up and down the East Coast the next couple of days. Back here at home, we had a few clouds today. Okay, a lot of clouds. High of only 67 degrees. The clouds, though, are starting to thin out. As you can see up in Fond du Lac, already starting to see a clear sky. No rain this evening, unlike last evening, where we had no severe weather, but just slow-moving downpours. And look at the rain. Milwaukee, record 4.79 inches of rain. Greendale and Greenfield, almost 7 inches of rain in a matter of hours. Uh, not everyone saw that rain, though. Here in Grafton and Cedarburg, about 2 to 2.5. But New Berlin had less than a half, and Whitefish Bay, just a third of an inch. Those are the downpours for you, especially when they're moving slow. They can create some flash flooding. Look at these temperatures right now. Upper 50s already in Waukesha and West Bend, 60 Beaver Dam, 58 Lake Geneva. Still holding on to 66 here in Milwaukee. So the Goddard Gauge tomorrow. Uh, tomorrow's day is, in my opinion, just amazing. But because it's about 10 degrees below normal and it's going to be a chilly morning, i got to give it a 7. 48. I said 48 in Watertown tomorrow morning. 50 in Waukesha, 56 in Milwaukee, 55 in Sheboygan. Tomorrow afternoon, nothing but sunshine. High right around 70 degrees. That, to me, especially if you're working outside, is ideal. But for summer lovers, eh, a little cool. The com comfortable dry air is for tomorrow, Wednesday, Thursday. It gets a little bit more humid on Friday, but we can deal with that. But if you like the humidity, it's back for the weekend. So once again, after lows tonight in the upper 40s to lower 50s, a high of 71 in Milwaukee, upper 60s elsewhere for the 4th of August. That's cool. Wednesday, the warm-up begins, 76. Then for Thursday, 78. Friday, a little bit more humid, and 80. Notice the dry conditions. For those of you that got three to six-plus inches of rain yesterday, you need those drier conditions. Saturday is 83 with an isolated thunderstorm and more humid. 86 on Sunday, and it will be steamy with dew points back into the 70s. So enjoy the cooler, drier air. It does make for some cool mornings. But summer's not done yet. We will be back uh, in the 80s with humidity by the weekend.